first game back in Seattle, or at least close to home. You played Seattle U. What was it like for you to put on a show here in front of your home crowd? Uh, it was definitely fun. It was fun for the team. It was fun for me. And so just whenever we can come out and compete, that's, that's a blessing. I mean, you led the led all. You had the most points and rebounds, but you didn't get the result tonight. How do you put a loss like this in perspective? I mean, a loss is a loss, and and we know what we did. We know we're just we keep coming up short in these uh, last few games, and so I think uh, Coach he touched on it uh, a few days ago. He's been talking about it. Ten to twenty percent more production out of all of us. Uh, twenty ten to twenty percent more effort, and so it's just what we got to do, and we didn't do it tonight. That first half response, you dub one up 27 to 13. You really started to be able to take advantage of them in transition and get them out of their 2 3 zone. I mean, what was working for you guys there on offense? I think we were just playing our game, moving the ball inside, in. in, <laughs> inside <laughs> out. Um, and just when, when we can get that ball moving around and, and get in everybody's hands, uh, we, we have playmakers, and so it's just, it's just on us to do that. You don't want to make excuses for any loss, especially one like this, but what do you think potentially having Robo out there might have done for you on both ends in a game like this? I mean, this is his presence on defense, his 6'9 body with, I mean, seven foot wingspan is, is it's a tremendous, I mean, just a piece that, that our main piece, our leader, and, you know, we need him tremendously uh, to be here for us. And, you know, he's been, he's been battling with uh, his own um, injuries and stuff. And so he just went him back healthy. And however long it takes him, I'm I mean, going to back uh, going off, yeah, Going off of what you said, when you went up 46 to 45, was it just kind of those same defensive areas you think that played out that allowed you to have to go on a big run like that? Yeah, and it just, we kind of gave it to him. You know, after we, we, we didn't get enough kills, and that's when we get three stops in a row. And we only had three. And so we were on the, the kill part nine, nine times we, we could have got a kill. And so... I think we didn't get enough stops this game. First Pac-12 game, though, for you, I asked Gervais the same question. What did you learn the most in this experience, in this environment? Uh, it's just a game of runs. You know, you can't get too down when, when the other team goes on a run. You just got to respond back and, and kind of buckle down. Seeing how tough you're able to play a team like this on the road when they come to Pullman in a month and a half, does that give you at least confidence for what you might be able to do when the roles are reversed and you have the home crowd backing oh, yeah, you? for sure, for sure.